there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of PlayStation Plus Freebies here on Pastiche of Skin. This is the PlayStation Plus Freebies for the month of January 2017. It is a whole new year. It's a new dawn. It's a new day. It's a new life for me. And I'm feeling good. So yeah, we're playing a little bit of Titan Souls. Now, from what I know of this, it's a top-down Dark Souls... Shadow of the Colossus slash Zelda slash Rogue like game. That's what I know about this. Apparently it's hard. It's so hard. So, so very hard. And Devolver Digital like punishing us. That's what I know. I could be completely wrong about this. But that's what I know about this off the bat. Let's see me get murdered. I said previously in other videos that I've... I'm not concerned about the constant use of roguelikes and procedurally generated levels and repetition of bosses. I don't, I'm not, I don't dislike it, but I'm starting to see like a dependency on that because it's about getting the iterated game loop. It's not about um, developing story or sense of location. It's essentially developing theme and gameplay loops, and it it doesn't give people that not an end or the a natural capability to finish. Something really quickly, um, not even quickly, but uh, from top, beginning, middle to end, actually having like a trajectory that the game goes on, and I, it's, it's something that I don't like in games. So I tend to play something like this for a very short period of time, then decide, oh, I need to put in some time, I need to set some time aside to really get into this, understand the mechanics of it, and then come back to start again from scratch in a way, because the way the rogue system, the roguelike system works here, got permadeath. Now... I can see why this was popular in its original design because it was innovative. No, this is not fucking innovative. This is just um, the way low budget, not low budget, but um, closer to indie title, double A, maybe single A games tend to be. And it means that I'm not, I, I'm seeing our, a mechanics driven, engineering driven game type that doesn't tickle my oyster. My, my oyster is tickled by narrative tales. I do like linear storytelling. I do like these things because of my love of film and TV shows and wanting to actually like follow a plot. My love of books, everything comes from that kind of like I'm on a journey to a destination. I like that predeterminism. With these, it's what you make while you're in there. The same feeling I have about sandboxes. It doesn't intrigue me. It, 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 it doesn't fire my imagination like trying to become somebody else for a period of time. And I'm sure there's a lot of reasons why I'm a bad it's a, I'm a bad gamer for maybe not wanting to accept it. But at the same time, it doesn't make me want to play. That's the problem. This is by play. You're meant to play a video game. And even though people say, like, oh, too many cutscenes mean I'm not really playing it. That's different. But cross you. doesn't matter about cross you. The fact that I'm a different person every time I play this, I'm not... I'm, even the idea, like, if I had the same character repeating their lives, I'd probably be more into it. But in the case that it's, like, a new guy every time, a new guy every time, like, there's nothing special about you. You're just another body who's doing this task. And I was like, really? Well, why do I care? <laughs> you know? Why, 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 why am I trying to change my persona to match every single iteration of this character? So, um, yeah, that's my mini rant gone. I shouldn't probably rant whenever I meant to be doing these quick game video game plays. But, yeah, let's see what Titan Souls brings me because I've got a feeling that this is about a single person, about a single tale. This could make me lo love it or hate it. The bond between man, bow, and arrow is perpetual and never ending. It is the life of the archer. Oh, I thought that was going to be like right control stick from um, shooting. Oh god, have I got like a single arrow for usage? Ah! Boom! Ding dong! Hit the door. Ah! Uh... <laughs> A boy and his arrow. Ow! Door. 
Uh-oh. Tuck and roll, bitch! Tuck and roll! Running! Ow! <laughs> I do like the fact that I'm actually torturing the doors. Well, apparently that's the checkpoint. Ow! 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 <laughs> I just, I'm getting way too entertained by this noise. Sounds like a mixture between a cat scream and... Oh, oh my. Oh, I can climb up here. Ow! My face. Ow! My face! Oh, shit. <laughs> that looks like one big giant eyeball. I think I might offend someone if I actually shoot that one. Let's find out. Huh, ah. All right, so I imagine I have to actually, there's four squares on that. There's four doors down here. I have to complete each of the four doors to then fight whatever it is that's down there. So if I go down here, I use that down the stairs. Woo! I like the fact that it goes to the bother of making the roll um, affected by the gravity of you going down the stairs. So you took the roll down the stairs, you ain't stopping. The fuck's this? Oh! Well, that's me, dead. Death by slime. So, that's a slime in there? Um, let's try something else. Is there a different boss in each one of these rooms? Whoa! Whoa! Oh! I die and I die again! Okay, so that one, I have to time it so that I'm hitting him as his face is exposed. Ow! Can't roll upstairs. Come on, this is... At least let me do Zelda style. Um. Whoa! Well? I will die, die, die again! I didn't even get a chance to see what that one was like. I think it was just an ice thing. See, can I run around it and see, find out what it's like? Ah! Ah! Uh, no! I think I figured it out. Ah! So what I need to do is time the attack so it goes through the flame and hits the guy. Oh! Clever bosses! Clever girl! Clever girl! I like that. So I've got, I figured out what that guy's mechanic is. These, the slime splits. Your man, you have to time your attacks. That, you have to run your shot through the fire. This, um... Jesus! What the fuck are you? Ow. 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 So I think my best chances of actually being able to do this is in this first, in this room. Because if I can just, all I have to do is kind of time my attack. Or I could roll straight into it and actually get killed immediately. I mean, that's my two options, really, in the gameplay. Mm-hmm. 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 That's fun. All right, I'm just going to try this one again. <laughs> I could be trying these for a while. And then get my ass beat. Ah! 
Ah! Ah! Help me! Ah! They're so big! So big and then so small! Oh, Jesus! Whenever there's too many of them. Ah! <laughs> Ah! So there's one that actually has the heart inside of it. The, I think that's the one I'm meant to be shooting at. But if I give them too many um, bodies, I'm pretty much spending all my time running. So I need to actually aim for the one that has the heart. Oh, God, if I could shoot it straight, that would be a good start. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh crap! That was a bad idea, but at least I can separate them out. Oh! Oh, this is awkward as hell. To actually hold down X to attack is... Oh yeah! Oh man! That's so good! I've almost got it! Oh shit! <laughs> no! Ah! 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 <laughs> so stressful! Ah, oh, come on! Give me the space I need! Oh, shit! Ah! Oh, no! <laughs> ah! No! <laughs> it was sitting right there all along! Do I need like one shot in its heart though to actually kill it as well? All right, let's try this again. Uh-oh. Ah! I'm cutting all the wrong ones. Ah. All right, I've cut all the wrong ones up. It's all gone horribly wrong. Ah! Why do they all stun look? Ah! Ah! I don't like this, I, I, right, so the mechanics of this game, I'm absolutely fine with, but why is it not mapped to these? It is. <laughs> Alright, I need to change the controls here. Um, is there a way to actually go back? No, I can't bring up menus at all. Alright, so... Because I was using X and Square, and it feels so, so damn uncomfortable, so I need to be using it this way instead. Feels so much easier. Ah, come on. Ah, shit. Come on, roll, roll. Ah, I ran straight into that one. Ah, guys. Titan Souls is obviously a frustrating <laughs> fucking game. Um, I'm sure there's a lot more to the gameplay than just these four bosses. Ow. I'm not getting good. I'm getting killed. Um, I'm sure there's actually about memorizing patterns and then just being ready for each one of them. This is a battle I'm not ready for. Look at him! Oh! <laughs> 
Oh, man. It's a dude from Fez. <laughs> uh. <laughs> that was interesting. I'm just chilling out here. You know, just killed like a, one of those eyeball bosses. Got a lucky with it, you know. Take him down. Is that one? Do I get anything for killing that one? Nope. No rewards for killing that boss. <laughs> Admittedly, it only took one hit to do so. Alright. Let's see. Oh, shit. Oh! <laughs> I said, she's like, I got myself pinned into the corner. He's like, I've got you cornered now. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, that was um, gratifying to get one kill in. I should have probably stopped it there and was like, yep, let's be retired. I'm a winner. I won. I killed that one. It's all over. So am I right about thinking that it's actually all four of those need to be killed? And then that's how I get into the main door up here. See if it actually lit up one of the boxes. No, it didn't. Okay. So, yeah. Titan Souls. Um, not what I was expecting in any way, shape, or form. My rant at the beginning about the uh, roguelike nature of uh, a lot of games being played today and the fact that I played a couple of rogues fairly recently on the channel. I had a massively incorrect assumptions about this. Titan Souls is a boss rush game. You fight bosses, each one of them have a one unique thing that actually takes them out. You have one shot. Don't they... Oh, oh god, I was about to go into the 8 mile rapping fucking thing and I lost the lyrics in my head. Uh, you got this one shot, one chance to glow. This opportunity comes in a once time, once in a lifetime, you know? Ah, it's, uh, I don't know, I'm not... What's... I don't know my reps. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, thanks very much for watching. This has been Titan Souls. I'm I, I I like this. I hate it, but I like it in a lot of ways. Um, simplified dodge mechanics. Um, the fact that I took a while to get understand that there was actually usage of controls here instead of actually using the these two because thumb rolling and shooting. I can see how it would work for a lot of people, but um, old fingers, man. <laughs> They're not going to work as well as they ever used to. So it's actually onto the trigger hands on the back and up and down here. That's probably my better chance of survival. Um, and I definitely don't know if I used that button because <laughs> the button's jammed. So yeah, um, guys, Titan Stoles, boss rush game. Fun, a very, very quick iteration. I imagine it's, uh, like I said, I think it was closer whenever I described it to uh, Shadows of Colossus than it is to uh, Rogue Legacy or anything like that enjoying this. Uh, I imagine that I, I there's power-ups to be had because I can see them this kind of thing in here where there's like three boxes above my character. I imagine that some form of power-up allows me to shoot multiple times, gives me fire arrows for some stupid thing or whatever else, but I like this. It's going to be a combination of mechanics and timing and skill that runs through it. I could see a lot of people spend a lot of time playing this and it's completely free and it's on, I think the bundle is PS3, PS4 and PS Vita. You could be playing this on anything anywhere really. Um, Titan Souls, I know, was an open access game, an early open early access game. So um, I'm sure that there's a lot of iterations have been made since. This is actually a finalized game now on the PS4, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, this has been a video for the PlayStation Freebies for the month of January 2017, and um, I'm I was I'm enjoy I'm joyfully hyped by the fact I managed to take down one boss on this video because otherwise I expect myself to feel feel so miserably but if you want to see me feel in other ways in other games make sure to hit that subscribe button up there because you'll be giving you notifications for every single time i feel miserably on the internet and over here on the side you see a bunch of video crap that actually has things that i've made over the last uh, year year and a half and maybe even something even earlier than that which mattering whether or not the google analytics decide that you must see my shitty short movies from a couple of years back um yeah go and check them out enjoy again thank you very much for watching Remember to actually like, comment, subscribe, and all that kind of crack. And I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye. I put that pen. Damn it. Now I look like an asshole. Screw you, internet!